Hello, in this lecture we will learn how you can render content conditionally. So in our simple app we have this is approved property which is set to true and in our HTML we have this simple div with project approved. So the challenge is we only want to display this project approved if our project is approved and how we can determine that from this property is approved. So currently it is set to true and that's why we should display project approved but if I set it to false like this and if I run my app there should be no project approved. So how can we do this with Vue.js? For this we have vif directive. So let's implement that. So in our div I will write vif is equal to and our property which is is approved so now let's run it okay it's gone now let's set it to true project approved is back so what's happening when we apply we if directive to this div and bind value of is approved to this div here we will get the value of is approved so this will be v if is equal to true and because v if becomes true this project approved gets rendered but as previously if i set it to false so that v if will become v if equals false and because our condition is false now this project approved won't get rendered See, so this is how you can implement simple v if, or I should change it to span. That's much better. Now let's say we have another scenario where we want to display if user is online or offline. So how we can do that? Let's write some code. So this is how our app looks if you want to display user is online or offline or you can say active or inactive. Now what will happen in first span we have v if is active so it will be true because of our property set to true. So we will get user is online rendered and in our second span we have same directive but value is not is active which turns not true to false so we will get v if equals to false and that's why we will not get user is offline so let's run it and we are getting user is online and let's turn it to false so this is how we can perform online and offline scenario but we can do it better how view just provides v else also so in our first span we will have v if is equal to is active and in our second span, instead of writing this v if again, we will use v else. Simple. And we are getting user is offline. And let's change it to true. User is online. Yeah, it is working. And because you probably learned all the things before, you guessed right that we are going to see if else if next. So let's dive in that. So this is our code, in our view we have status pending, in our HTML we have first span with directive of v if we checks status equals approved and one more thing, this v if directive should only get boolean value so it must have true or false and this is javascript expression status double equals approved which will result in false because our status is pending. So it will become v if equals false, which is boolean. And because v if equals false, our project approved span won't get rendered. Now one step down, we have v else if, which is another Vue.js directive to implement else if. This checks for status equals pending, and yes, our status is pending, and it will return true. And that's why this project status is pending get rendered, and we are getting that. 
and because our condition is true we else won't get checked now let's change our status to check project approved project is rejected and because we have v else here if i pass anything here it will be rejected this is just for demo purpose okay don't make this kind of silly mistakes